Jessica Paul, it's been a crazy day here at the Capitol, something we've never seen before. The House Speaker comes up to the media gallery and blames the Democrats for why this budget bill did not pass. But two Democratic representatives were standing by, called him out, and that's when words were exchanged. You guys need to support this. This is. I'm glad you think so. That's House Speaker Charles McCall and Representative Corey Williams from the Democratic Party exchanging words in the press gallery. This all happened during the House vote over raising taxes on cigarettes, fuel, and alcohol. The House Speaker came up to the gallery to tell us it was up to the Democrats to change their vote as it stood on the board 54-44. We have made every compromise possible. It is time, and it is actually past time, of partisan politics. That's when Representative Williams chimed in. It's not entirely true. Doesn't it result in guts? The... Excuse me, I'd like to finish. The Democrats requested gross production tax raises to be included in the bill, which the Speaker said he would put it on the board as a standalone bill. Would you support as it? Soon it, as it I'm supporting it by putting it on the board. That's not true. To give them a vote on it. And House leadership still hasn't said what plan B is, but some are calling for both sides to come back to the negotiating table and find a bipartisan agreement. We're live at the state capitol tonight. Brett Boganski, KOCO 5 News.